Hello, this is Jay Black with Tekken 2. In this video, we're going to go over how to nest our Circon XT multi-layer in the InLab Cam 19 software. First thing we're going to do is go to New Job, choose MCX5, choose our restorations we want to nest, select our blank, we're going to click on New Blank, choose Dense Fly Serona, Circon XT multi-layer, choose our size of our disk, enter the enlargement factor, And you'll find all of this information on the top of the disk. Okay, you can see we have our shade, height, our scale, our X, Y, and Z that we entered in just now. The key way at the top is for uh, third-party mills, and the bottom is for the InLab MCX5. Okay, while you're forward, position our restorations however you want it in the disk. You can also, first, after you do it horizontally, you'll go vertical. Here you can see the different transitional layers in the disk. If you want more incisal, you'll raise it more to the top of the disk. Less incisal, you'll bring it down. You can also rotate it as well. These layers right here correspond to the layers on the Circon XT multi-layer disk shown here. Here you can see a breakdown for a 18 millimeter disk. We have 20% incisal. 10% transitional layer 2, 10% transitional layer 1, and 60% dentin. That's for an 18 millimeter disc. And you can see the breakdown for the different disc heights of 14, 18, and 25 millimeter. You can see the 25 millimeter has more dentin in it. All right. These transitional layers help us to get a lot truer shade, in my opinion. Once we're happy with how much in size we want, we'll go to sprue positioning. Position our sprues wherever we want. We want to get them off of our contacts. Arrow forward. Choose our production option and we're ready to mill. Thanks for joining us on this Tekken 2 on how to nest Circon XT multi-layer in the CAM 19 software. Thank you very much.